The mother of a Springfield man killed by the DEA is sharing memories of her son tonight. This is Color 10 News at 6. I'm Heather Lewis. David has the night off. 25 year old Caleb Slay was shot by agents on Monday after what the DEA is calling a physical altercation. Our Jesse Inman is here with us tonight. He has more on the case and what Slay's mother is saying about it. Yeah, this happened in the 1800 block of South Maryland near Sunshine. And according to a press release sent to us by the DEA, agents approached an individual who they believed committed a violation, one that the Springfield police confirmed to me today was related to drugs. Now, the DEA says they were engaged in conversation when Slay walked up and, and made the approach. They say that a physical altercation ensued, resulting in agents shooting and killing him. And today, we met with Tina Slay Richardson, Caleb's mother. She spoke about the memory of her son and says that she is still searching for answers regarding her son's death. She explained her frustration with the way her family was treated at the scene that night and upset that the information was released so quickly to the public. Now, she wants answers on why her son had to be shot, and she's making calls for change. This has got to stop. I didn't want to join this club. I'm in this club now. And I am a staunch investigator of my own. I don't let anything go. And with my last breath on this earth, I will get justice for my son. And I feel like we weren't treated with enough respect. And it's wrong. The DEA also says a firearm was recovered at the scene there. The Springfield police are now left to investigate the entire incident. They were not able to confirm to me today whether or not the firearm was in possession of Slay at the time of the shooting tonight at 10. You'll hear more about the memory of Tina's son and the family's plan going forward. Heather.